Good morning, guys. I'm slightly out of it. Awesome. Peace. Yeah. Um, so I'm sitting here with the kids and we're doing learning things. I need to charge my camera. Apparently the battery is dying. Yay. Um, got my hot chocolate here. It should be coffee, but hot chocolate it is. John has got to go look at that house. Um, and he might go to uh, the cell phone store after who knows um, to get our phones I need to do the dishes our little kitchen is a wreck because if we even cook one small thing that's what it turns out to be it turns out to be a mess I think we're going to do some more I don't know learning this stuff today maybe watch this a few movies Maybe go somewhere. I don't know. I haven't decided what we're going to do. I just feel like being lazy today. I honestly just don't want to go anywhere. I'm kind of bummed out that I didn't get to go see the house. So, I'm just, I'm being pouty and lazy today. Cheers. So, I don't know how many Cinderella movies there really are, but there's a lot. Like, I'm watching this one right now. Anyways, not really watching it. It's more of on in the background. But the kids are supposed to be taking it out. Not really happening. Um, we played a little while at the table doing learning activities. And then out of nowhere, I get an ad for ABC Mouse, which is something that we have been looking into for a while to get for the kids. Um, we have just we never did it so it was um an ad for like two months for 5.95 i think is what it was so i figured you know what why not let's try it out and see if they like it before we commit to buying the full thing so this is what it looks like so far like that's kimber's this is kimber's page so um i'm excited to see how they like it I'm not going to let them play with it until um, they take a nap and wake up. It's kind of like a surprise for them. But I think it's really going to help them a lot, especially Audric, because there are certain things that he does struggle with that his teacher told me about. So I'm hoping that'll help him. And then also, I mean, Kimber's getting ready for preschool. So um, hopefully that'll help her too. There's like different levels that they can do and then they get like tickets um, where they can buy stuff for their rooms on the site and different clothes, different things for their hamsters. Like they have hamsters and fish. It's really cool. I didn't realize that they had that much stuff. So I'm excited about that. I haven't heard from John yet. It's currently 1.18 p.m. and the house viewing was at 11, so I know he told the guy that took him that he was going to treat him to lunch, so I don't know if they are um, getting lunch or if they're doing the phone thing. I don't, I don't really know. So I've just been chilling out, like I said, hanging out with the kids, doing learning activities. Um, I've also been doing research on running 5Ks and 10Ks. So, um, I don't think I mentioned this, but one of my New Year's resolutions that I'm, like, I didn't even make them for New Year's. I'm just kind of coming, like, I'm kind of making them up as I go along in 2017, basically. So, um, one of the resolutions I have is to run a 10K in 2017. So, that's just something that I've been thinking about the past couple months or so. Like, I would love to get into the shape to complete a 10K and say that I did it. Um, so, anyways, one of my friends that I met here at the hotel actually told John about it. He had to go drop off something at their room that he borrowed. And she told him about it. So, he came back and told me about it. That Disneyland Paris is having a half marathon this year. So I'm really excited because I've always wanted to do um, a Disney race. And I just obviously never, you know. I mean, 
what am I trying to say? I didn't really want to do it. I didn't want to do the running part. I wanted to do it just because I wanted to, um, you know, dress up in the costumes and all that cool stuff. But blah, blah, blah. I'm going to do this race with her in September. And I'm super excited about it. And I'm excited to start training, believe it or not. So I've been doing research on how to train. Um, doing the couch to 5K. And then going into um, the 5K to 10K. So I have nine months to do all of this. And I want to start this upcoming week on training. Um, so it's going to be about 16 weeks. 16 to... Um... 16 to 20 weeks, I'll say, of training total. And I'm bent and determined to do it. Um, I do need new running shoes, so I'm excited about that. And I kind of want a Fitbit, maybe, if John will agree to it. Anyways, John told me that he will pay for everything if I commit and get into shape and train and do this. He will pay for everything, like the trip there, my food the registration, all that stuff. So I am all for it. I'm going to do it. I am going to get into shape. I know that's everyone's New Year's resolution, but really, I need to really work on my fitness. Oh my goodness. I'm having like some serious heartburn today. And I'm tired. Go figure. I've actually been sleeping very well the past couple nights. I have been sleeping from like... Last night I slept... A good eight hours straight which is amazing I went to sleep around 10 or 11 and I slept till seven something I don't know it was it was amazing so I found a sitter possibly that can watch the kids on Tuesday when we go see the house that we're like really 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 wanting the number one house on our list so we're supposed to meet her sometime at some point this weekend and hopefully it works out and she can watch them for however long we're gone, like an hour or so on Tuesday, just so I can see this house myself. <sighs> and I can help express to the landlord how much we want it. If it's not taken, we have Sunday, Monday, two, we have three days. 